वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स लेट अस सी अ वेरी सिंपल एंड इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन बेस्ड ऑन द टॉपिक सबसेट्स फ्रॉम द चैप्टर सेट्स ओके ऑल द क्वेश्चंस आर बेस्ड ऑन द सब टॉपिक सबसेट्स सो हेयर क्वेश्चन इज एग्जामिन वेदर द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट्स आर ट्रू और फॉल्स फर्स्ट ए बी इज नॉट बिलोंगिंग टू दिस सेट having elements b c and a so what is your opinion whether it is true or false first what do you think is it true no this is false how because here elements a b are belonging to this set a and b are belonging to set but their statement is that whether this entire set is belonging to this set or not so entire set is not belonging to this set only elements of this set a and b are belonging to this set here this is a subset of this set but this set itself is not belonging to this set this set is not a member of this set okay second here this set left hand side set is having members a and e and right side sets are having elements x where x is a vowel in the english alphabet means here two is if we write this statement in the tabular form this is mentioned in set builder form we have already discussed in previous videos that there are two types of sets uh, we can mention in two different ways one is tabular form whether every elements every members are mentioned written clearly and another is symbolically this is written in set builder form so when you write this set you will find that this set is having elements a e and this set is having elements all the vowels a e i o u so what do you think whether it should be a subset or not definitely it is a subset because here both the elements a and e are available in this set a and e here so this is a subset it means this is true correct now let us see third question here 1 2 3 are the members of left hand side set and 1 3 5 are members of right hand side set and here symbol is subset so we have to decide whether this set is a subset of this set or not so definitely this is not a subset what is the reason because 2 is available in this set which is not belonging to this set so this statement is false and what is the reason as 2 is not belonging to this set 2 is not belonging to the given set 1 3 5 okay now let us see fourth here whether this set is a subset of this set or not definitely it is the statement is true because each and every element of this set of course it is having only one element so this element is also available in this set right hand side set so by the definition of subset this is a subset of this bigger set so this is true and hope you recall Uh, the definition of subsets set a is called subset of set b if each and every element of set a is also available in set b on that basis here this element a is available here so this set is a subset so statement is true now fifth set a is belonging to this set or not no this is false 
let us make it clear here this element element a is belonging to this set this entire set is not belonging to this set here this notation of subset is okay but here notation is member belonging to so this entire set a entire set having element a is not belonging only element is belonging but here it is being asked that this set is belonging so this is false correct and last sixth here x is an even natural number less than 6 so you know even natural number less than 6 are 2 and 4 here notation is given in statement subset and this set of right hand side is x such that x is a natural number which divide 6 natural number divide 6 so one divides every number so that is 1 2 Three, four, six, nine, twelve, eighteen, thirty-six. All these natural numbers divide thirty-six. So we have to justify whether this left-hand side set is a subset of this set or not. Of course. this is a subset because here elements in this left hand side set are 2 and 4 which are available here 2 and 4 so every element of this set is available in this set it means this is a subset of this bigger set so this statement is true so these are very simple basic questions conceptual questions based on the topic subsets i uh, hope you have understood it very well we will see some more question interesting question important questions in other videos too so please keep watching these videos and take maximum advantage of these videos thank you very much